Greetings nerds and welcome to a brand new series of this art channel. This series is actually it's going to be a tutorial series and these tutorial videos will actually be uh, art tutorials. I'm going to teach you how to draw this. I'm going to teach you how to draw that without any problems. So, welcome to the very first tutorial video. This series is called How to Make Art Like a Nerd. And I'm really excited to begin a brand new series, so I'm going to teach you nerds how to draw the AND symbol. So in every tutorial video, we're not going to use rulers, we're not going to use, well, we are going to use pencils, pens, and, and markers, but we don't use rulers. Nerds use their minds. Yes, they use their minds. And their minds will help them uh, control their whatever hand they write with or draw with. So, for me, t and I'm, I'm an, uh, a lefty, so my mind controls my left hand. So we don't need rulers. Who needs rulers? Not nerd. Not the nerds or any other nerds out there. Well, I don't know. But let's get started, shall we? All right. So you want to start off with a diagonal. Now the and symbol doesn't have to be perfect. So we're going to start off with a diagonal line that looks. Like that. May not be the perfect, may not be the best diagonal line, but the diagonal line should look something like this. Okay, and then you want to create a, a hook that's going to look like this. It's going to look like a Santa sleigh just shooting up to the sky. Or it kind of looks like a diagonal... Uh, candy cane. So this is what it should look like so far. And then you want to create a much more longer hook. And you want it to touch this this line. And you're going to get that diagonal P. So that's the trick to doing like starting about starting half of the AND symbol, you'll get that diagonal P. Now to finish the other half of the symbol, you want to create a line that's going to eventually curve. It should look something like this. This looks almost like a ribbon. And then you want to create a longer curve and you want it to touch this diagonal line so it should look something like this and then you just want to make this line cross and that's how you draw the AND symbol simple as one two three and ABC. So there you have it. I hope this tutorial video was enjoyable to watch. I know it's not all that, I know it's not really entertaining or anything, but these tutorial videos will start off easy and then as we go they'll get much more challenging and, and harder. But Jules Nerdy is always here for art content. Well, not really. Only on Mondays, only on Mondays, Wednesdays and Fridays, but 
that is the end of this tutorial video. I hope this video was enjoyable and helpful to watch. I will catch you nerds later.